What's up, Bass Babes? I just made it to work. I wake up with a puffy face. Y'all ever wake up with a puffy face? I'm wearing an orange bandana today. How y'all doing? How are you doing? <laughs> I just got in. I have about, whew, I have about 15 minutes. So I need to turn all my lights on and get this day started. The kids are testing today. So I'm trying to catch up on grades and still deal with parents but right now i think i think i have most of my grades done i mean at zero to zero there's nothing i can do i can't chase you down to do your work Ugh. and i hear it's like all over the u.s where schools have had this problem kids not doing the work i think it's a huge responsibility to put on a, on a child but anyway this is how i was feeling today it's like a whole mood you know i know i look a little crazy you, you know that's okay so i got my little orange bandana i'm not trying to you know work nobody's colors here so i chose an orange bandana and don't worry about it i know i look crazy i i know i do okay you you don't got to tell me okay i know yeah i know <laughs> Oh, I want to give a little shout out to Penny. Hey, Penny girl. Penny is a seven-year-old. She gets notifications when I post a video. She's like, Mom, can we stop? Joy is on. Joy is on. Oh, my gosh. That just warmed my heart so much. Hey, Penny girl. So, I want to show you guys my outfit. Maybe I'll come back in the afternoon with my face not so puffy, okay? Okay, so I don't know what you can see. So this is a little, it's actually a dress. I've worn this before, and I, this is a little sweatshirt kind of thing. Um, I've worn this before too. I wanted someone to hold the camera for me, but she's not in yet. So, and I put it on, I always put it on with some pants and my little heels. So I am just a whole mood today. I wish I had one of those things that keep the, your skirt out, that keeps it out. So. And then this belt, I've had this belt for years, years and years and years. It was my first Gucci belt. And I've probably had this belt for Oh, Clinton is 19. I probably had this belt for 20, 30 years, maybe 30 years. And I used to be a tiny little thing, but back in the day, we wear our pants up here, but now I wear my pants low. <laughs> and so, so Bobby has taken over this belt, so she wears it all the time. So I had to go in her room today and get my belt. <laughs> So, that is my outfit of the day. I hope you guys are doing well. I just got in. I was running a little late because I didn't know what to bring for. I was running late. And I get dressed in the morning. I pick my outfit out in the morning. Let me know in the comment section below if you pick your clothes out the night before. So, I just get dressed real fast. I don't know. I just go in the closet. Okay, I'm going to do this, this, and this. And then first I had the the sweatshirt out of the dress i was like no i'm not feeling that then i put the front part in the dress and i leave the back part out in this sweatshirt i did not cut i bought it like this <laughs> but i'll buy an oversized hoodie and then i'll just chop them in half but i'll leave the back longer i've shown a video on how i do my my uh sweatshirts and um, my little orange bandana. So I feel as though I'm a whole mood today. So therefore, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, day, day. And I always try to do something that's different. First, I had on some, um, I don't know, it's called some where the pattern is little black and white boxes. Little boxes, boxes. It's like the checkered pattern. First, I had those pants on with the polka dot dress. I was like, ah. I'm not feeling that. And then I was like, oh, I have these little orange pants. So I'm coordinated, coordinated today. <laughs> and these shoes are actually quite comfortable, but I wanted to polish my toenails. Look, I got four minutes. I got four minutes. I got some quick, dry polish. All I need to do is the first three toes. Boop, boop. That's how you do it. They can't, I ain't taking my shoes off. And I'm babysitting, um, a teacher's class today 
because he has a doctor's appointment. So I have his first period. First period is usually my planning. So he has an activity for them to do. So while they're doing their stuff, I'm gonna try to plan for next weekend. Oh, let me tell y'all, let me tell y'all, right? Let me um, turn my lights on in class. So let me tell y'all. <sighs> Only people who know me and who have been following me will know this, that my robe is very special to me. <laughs> my robe, say hi y'all. Say hi to my little buddy. Say hi to my little buddy, I love him. He's cute. And uh, my robe is special. My robe, I can't go to sleep without my robe. I've had that robe probably 30 years. And I just have to have it on me. So Bay Daddy bought me a weighted blanket. It's a, it's, it's a 15 pound blanket. And I've always wanted a weighted blanket. So I was like, what's this in the mail? This is heavy. I'm like, what they send me some? Weights? Trying to tell me something? <laughs> I know, I done gained the COVID-15. <laughs> but anyway, so Bay Daddy sent me the blanket. Baby! Let me tell you, I turn my little, my little smell good on. So baby, let me tell you, honey, I don't even use the, my, my, my little uh, robe anymore. And that robe, that robe has made people jealous. They like, you like that robe, baby, you like me. It's just been with me. It's just my robe, okay? And so, um, I've had it for two days now, and honey, I don't even think about the robe. It is like, oh, it is awesome. And I now that I'm putting two and two together, I think that I like the robe because I like the little bit of weight from the robe. So now, oh my gosh, sleeping with the weighted blanket is the best thing ever. It's like comforting. It's like... It's like a comfort, I'm telling you. This is not a sponsored video and I meant to bring the bag with me, but I'm telling you, you need to get you, look, I'm on a bike, y'all. <laughs> you need to get you a weighted blanket. I'm telling you, it is awesome. Look, thank you. <laughs> I love, love, love the weighted blanket. It is awesome. I don't know, it just does something. I haven't even thought about that robe. Now would I choose the robe over the weighted blanket? Now that I've had the experience with the weighted blanket, I will have to go with the weighted blanket. I laid down when I got home yesterday. I think I left school almost at seven o'clock. And I laid down and I was like, Joy, just lay down, get some rest for a little while. And Bobby cooked. So when I got home yesterday, listen, 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 calm down, calm down. I got, wait, I really got three minutes. All right, so listen, 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 quack, 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 quack. So I got home yesterday, right? And Bobby, and I had to drop Sydney off to Bible church something. Ooh, and I was tired. She said, you think you can drop me off? I got to be there at 7.30. So I made it home by 7.40. So she's learning to drive. So she's like, no, 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 I'll drive. So she drove and I was like, yeah, I'm hungry. Um, I've been eating the noodles from Connie. Child. Ooh, Connie, the, the veggie ones are good. Those good. And I just add a little bit of chicken to them. So I was like, you know, <sighs> I'm hungry and I know it's nothing at home to eat. We don't even got no meat in the freezer right now. But you know, you can always find something. I can always make a meal out of nothing. That's when you know you are mama, mama. You, you better eat a mayonnaise cracker sandwich because we got, we don't got no bread at home right now. You know, I, I gotta go to the grocery store, but I just been tired, right? So quiet. So I was like, dang, what I'm eat? So I was like, let me just go get this $5 Little Caesar pizza. I got two, $10. And see, we don't mind heating up the Little Caesar's pizza. It, yeah, we love it. We put it in a toaster oven. It's be good, especially when you hungry. Right, Penny? You hungry, you gonna eat that pizza, right? When mommy cook you something, don't complain. You better eat that, Penny. Uh-uh, you better eat that, girl. So anyway. I got home. I bought the two little shit. I got home. I was like, oh, so you cooked. 
child we we do have um um tilapia fish fillets you know the individually packaged we do have those in the freezer and she was like yeah i didn't know you were getting pizza i was like she was like oh you know i love pizza so and the fish was good she chopped up onions put spinach and little foil pouches and she made rice basmati rice for carnage chow. and um it was good so we we did eat the pizza. We we love Little Caesars pizza. Mm -hmm. That's my cue, y'all. So I better get out of here. And uh, so we love the Little Caesars pizza. But when I go home, I'm gonna be eating fish, rice, and some broccoli. Oh, it's gonna be good. I haven't had a home cooked meal in a long time. So it's gonna be nice to to eat a meal. You know, a home cooked meal. I just, I just been tired, and sometimes I just don't want to cook. I don't feel like it, really. So it was a nice surprise, and the kitchen was clean. <laughs> so Bobby told, I'm um, Sydney. Sydney told me she's like, I clean the kitchen, but I know it's your pet peeve. So I don't want you to come home to a dirty kitchen, and it's not fair that Bobby hasn't cleaned the kitchen. <laughs> and so I went, and she said, and don't tell her that I said that because she's gonna get mad at me. <laughs> so I was like, Bobby, um, so. You know, you need to clean the kitchen too. And you know, I don't think it's fair that Sydney, but I did tell Sydney in our private conversation, but they don't watch my my videos anyway. Penny, thank you for watching because my girls don't. And you know, all my five, six, seven million subscribers. <laughs> so anyway, <laughs> so, um, so I told Sydney, I said, but then Bobby will cook dinner. She does make your lunch. She does a lot for you too, Sydney. So Bobby's like the other mom in the house. And, and you know, she'll pack her lunch, make her sandwiches, fix her plate for dinner. Sydney's spoiled. She's she's the baby, so she's a little spoiled. And she was like, I know, but still, she should also have to do the dishes. And child, there's some other news I got to give y'all, but I'm gonna let Sydney give it to y'all. Um, I think she'll be home today. I'm gonna to leave work one time today so hopefully I won't be so tired especially with the kids testing because sometimes when you're up teaching you it's like you're performing and when I was doing the um, um, exam review it was straight it was straight teaching back to back back to back back to back so it, it was exhausting so I think today I won't I may not be as tired so I'm looking forward to that to try to catch up and work on lesson plans for next week so I can at least experience a weekend. So I'm going to uh, vlog when I get home. So with that said, you guys have a wonderful, 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 wonderful day. <laughs> and my little polka dots. <laughs> Alright guys, I love you. Thank you for watching me, even with my silly videos, my complaining videos. But I'm never going to let anybody rob me of my joy consistently. I might get a little attitude. You know, it's just part of life, okay? You know, I'm going to get attitude because it is what it is. But I'm always going to come back to the joy side because that's what I do. Oh, let me show you my message on my door. Hold on, calm down. Because that class is going to be coming in here in about 20 minutes. So this is on my door. Be thankful Thursday. Let your smile change the world, but don't let the world change your smile. Summative test today. <laughs> you know, I give them something positive, and I'm like, bam. Sorry, guys, but you have a test today. <laughs> So I hit it with the, the one, two, one, two. All right, guys.